Hey, what's swagging players? Last video, I forgot to show you guys the playoff tree, but here we go. Here's what the playoffs is looking like, man. In the series, matchups are kind of crazy. And out of the series that we have going on in my My Career Playoffs, let me know which series you think is more likely to go to a Game 7. Also, what series you think would be the biggest... No, I can't even say upset because these all are like very great teams. So what, what higher seed you think is more likely to lose to a lower seed in these playoffs so far, man? And now we got to go into Game 3. Games 1 and 2 have not been easy. So now we're going into Game 3 in San Antonio. I got a feeling this is going to be a crazy one. Got a feeling this is going to be a classic. Make sure you strap on your seat belts, get your popcorn, and enjoy the ride. Let's go. M -O Hey, what's good, swag team, homie, zombie gang, homie? It's your boy Stax Montana, man, back out here with the sixth guy himself. Killer, cam teammate, see my boy Eric Gordon wide open for three views from the tray. And that's the way we need to start this game off, man. You do know we lead the series 2-0. For those who have been watching, you know those were the most difficult two games of my, my career, YouTube career, ever, man. Those two games was crazy. We was down by a combined like 36, almost 40 points in those two games that we ended up coming back to win. So definitely go check those games out if you haven't. But in this game right here, it seemed like the Spurs came out with a whole different game plan. And that game plan was to not let Cameron Baker shoot the ball. Do not give this man any space. Double team if we have to. Triple team if we have to. But we are not allowing this man Cameron Baker to beat us yet again. And for the most part, it was working, you know what I'm saying? They was keeping the ball out of my hands. I wasn't really taking that many shots, and the shots that I did take were very contested, and I ended up missing. But one thing that they did not factor in, views from the tray, by the way, is my playmaking ability. You cannot stop this sixth guy completely. You can slow him down, but you can never, ever completely stop this man because he can make plays for his teammates, views from the tray. He can have the worst of guys playing like the best of guys, you know what I'm saying? He can have the worst guys out here looking like Kobe and LeBron. And that's exactly what this guy is out here doing right now. As you see my boy Marcia Gortat with the slam out here. It's the first quarter and my man Cam broke off seven assists already out here helping the squad. You don't want to let me shoot. Hey, man, I'm going to get my teammates to shoot. This time I tried to attack the basket. Ended up getting fouled, man. I had a little Patty Mills on me. I thought, why not? Attack the basket, but you already know how I do. You already know how I do with these free throws. I get the ball. Referee, thank you. Get my dribble on. Dribble. 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 Pause for the bitches. And then I get the bucket. You already know we got to swag on and go two for two. So I get the ball again. Referee, thank you. Get my dribble on. Dribble. 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 Pause for the bitches. And then I get the buckets again. Like I said, man, the Spurs was running some type of crazy defense. Like, man, do not let Cam get any type of open shots. So I had to move without the ball just to get a contested layup. Do you see how much defense, how much attention Cam is getting, bro? I had to run without the ball just to get just to get a contested layup, goddamn. So it's kind of real out here. Last seconds of the game, I mean, or the quarter right here, going all the way, getting that, not even an easy, but I was about to say easy bucket. It wasn't easy. It was really contested. So that's just goes to show how much attention they are giving to the six guy out here. They do not want me to beat them yet again. The first two games, man, I had to put the squad on my back. Another assist for Cam right there. Had to put my squad on my back and take them to that promised land. So they're like, no way, no sir, no way. You're not going to do that again. You're not going to do that to us again. That's smart goddamn defense. 
that's a smart game plan by Greg Popovich, but like I said, you can never completely stop the six guy, man. You can only slow him down. You can't even slow him down for long. Not even for a whole game. You can slow him down just a little bit. He always going to strike back. Ended up getting subbed out. We up by one. I was praying that we don't end up down by 10 when I get back in the game, but we still got our lead. My man Ryan Anderson should have stepped back, shot a three, but he missed it anyway. So it doesn't matter. Posting up, but now he wide open for the... You should have dunked, bro. Ryan Anderson, bro, you got to go, bro. You should have dunked that one, bro. They already think you soft in these streets. You got to dunk it from time to time. Kawhi Leonard on your boy. Last two minutes of the goddamn quarter going all the way easy. You know what? I'm just going to stop saying the word easy, bro, because the Spurs aren't letting Cam get anything easy. Kawhi Leonard wide open for the mid-range. My boy Kortai ended up contesting. I grabbed the board. Looking to push this fast break, man. I'm like, hey, if I'm not, if I'm no good to my squad out here trying to score, I'm gonna try to pass. This time I fake him with the post move going all the way. And Tim Duncan was the flagrant necessary. I mean, we made both free throws. Cam made both free throws, but was the flagrant necessary? I don't think so, man. I, I would expect so much more from Tim Duncan. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't expect that man to come out here hacking. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't expect him to come out here trying to slam Cam on his neck. But, you know, even even the even the greats out here, you know what I'm saying, taking little cheap shots at your boy. But it's all good, man. Cam is so goddamn used to it, dog. Look at my man Eric Gordon, though. He trying to turn up. He like, man, Cam is out here having a bad shooting night. You know what I'm saying? Because all of my shots are contested. All of my shots is, is guys right there. They're bad shots. You know what I'm saying? All of our shots are bad shots. So, they're like, he having a bad shooting night. Well, let's come out here and try to help this man. As you can see, I took old-ass ball spot. Manu Ginobili to the basket right there. That, that was something simple. You know what I'm saying? We don't worry about stuff like that. That was simple. Like I said, man, Cam's out here having a bad shooting night. Let's step up for that man. Let, let's step up for him. Let's rally for him. He, as much as he did for us, another and one swag for that man, Cam. Coming through. You already know what we got to do with these free throws. Referee, thank you. Get my dribble on. Dribble, dribble, dribble. Pause for the bitches. And then I get the buckets to complete that three-point play. Like I said, man, my teammates, man, I appreciate these guys. They're coming out here playing their hardest for me. End up grabbing that rebound right there. We still down by five in this game, so we got a lot left to do. Pulling up the mid-range shot. That's buckets all oh, day and night. I wish it was a three, man. I wish it was a three, but hey, man, we'll take we, we, what we can get. We aren't getting much, bro. We only got 19 points here. Look at Anthony Davis stepping up on defense. Look at my man Eric Gordon once again on the fast break cherry picking, man. Shout out to my man Eric Gordon out here doing his thing. And I'm happy in this game. We didn't go down by 10. We didn't go down by 20. We didn't go about down by 30 in this game, bro. So I'm happy we did that in this game. Eric Gordon again out here doing his thing. So we play consistent defense, consistent offense pretty much throughout this whole game. It's a very close one. Only down by one at this point. You already know. I'm looking to take the lead here. Throwing this man in the post. Looking for my teammates, Mario Chalmers. It's a me. Yeah. Views from the tray. Mario out here doing his thing. Getting the ball top of the key. Boris D. Boris D. Boris D. Out. On your boy. Hit him with the spin move. Step back. But look at Ryan Anderson. Uh, no, I'll take it back, Ryan Anderson. You ain't soft, fam. I understand you're just trying to get your jump shot right. You feel me? That's, I, I, all right. We see you, man. You don't, you don't want to dunk it. Just trying to get your jump shot right out on these streets. Get the bar here in the corner. Surprised they, well, they go to double team right there. See, I was just about to say, I'm surprised they ain't doubling, but look at my man, it's a me, a Mario, out here knocking down shots. Tony Parker trying to take my man Drew to the rack, but no way, no sir. My man Martian Gortat said, no way, no sir. Throwing it up to Eric Gordon, Mr. Cherry pick himself. Out here doing this thing on a fast break. And I can't believe the score here in the fourth quarter. Usually in the fourth quarter, we fighting to make a comeback. But in this game, we got the lead, and these guys are trying to make a comeback. Wide open shot. Views from the tray. You know I had to knock that one down. Like I said, I'm not getting many opportunities to score. But every time I do get a wide open shot or something like that, man, I'm taking it and I'm making it. So just, just keep that in mind, dog. I'm missing a lot of shots, but, hey, at least I'm making the ones I'm supposed to make going all the way. Try to change my shot up for another and one. End up missing it, but it's all good, man. We, we get the free throws, and you already know I made both of those damn things. We don't miss our free throws. They cherry pick. If you want a full court press, this 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 is what we do. You, you're going to be looking a mess, you know what I'm saying? You want a full court press, your defense going to be looking a mess as we um, go ahead and get the easy basket right there. It was full court pressing, but they stopped this design. They trapped us a little bit. 
pick and roll my man Anthony Davis, sling the ball inside to him easy. That, that's, that's all day long, you know what I'm saying? Now we're just trying to close this game out here in the fourth quarter. Haven't had much opportunities like this. Look at my man LaMarcus Aldridge with the miss. My man Cameron just racking up the rebounds, racking up the assists, racking up the points here. Tony Park on your boy. I want to take advantage, but Eric Gordon views from the tray. He has definitely been the X factor this game. No doubt about it. Eric Gordon has stepped up like to where Cam can just take a rest. And as you see, I got a 20-20-20 game. Views from the tray. Make that a 27-20-20 game. As the man Cam is still out here hooping, bro. Still out here finding shots for himself. Try to get this pick and roll going. Crossing over. Going all the way to the basket. Little as Tony Parker can't stop me. We're just over a minute left in the game. It's looking like we might go ahead and close this one out on the Spurs. But you can never count the Spurs out. Down by four. Look what these guys do. Try to get this simple pick and roll with Anthony Davis. The most dangerous pick and roll in the league. He ends up turning the ball over. And I cannot catch up to Tony Parker who gets the easy layup. So now it's a two-point game. Just a little over 20 seconds left. And now, bro, we need a basket here, bro. We cannot go into overtime against these guys. Throwing it to AD. And right before the buzzer go off, Anthony Davis finds a way to get the ball up and in a basket. This is what I'm talking about. My teammates stepping up for your boy. All we got to do is play defense one last time here. Kawhi with the ball. I thought he was going to shoot. I jumped up in the air. Good thing he didn't. Danny Green misses. We grab the rebound. They fouled the homie Drew Holiday. There was not yet in the bonus. So, man, they got a foul again. This time, I'm trying, running down here to try to get the ball. Fam. I'm like, no way. They're not going to miss these free throws. I grab the ball, and these dudes do not even foul. So, we walk out of here in San Antonio with another win. And I'm surprised, man. I thought this was going to be the hardest game of them all. But it seems like at home, they got nervous in front of their home fans, man. And it's gave the game away. But, hey, man, is this your first time watching a Stax Montana video? First of all, slap the shit up out yourself because you should have known about me earlier. Then go ahead and subscribe. If you want to see more of my career videos featuring a six guy himself, Mr. 2020-20, make sure you leave a like on this one. It lets me know you're enjoying the series, and I definitely keep posting more. But until next time, players, real niggas stay up and I am out. Swag team, bitch, zombie gang, cuz. And you already know I'm on that Hall of Fame. 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 Let's go. Hey y'all, Ernie Johnson here along with Kenny Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. Welcome back for the presentation of our Jordan player of the game, Freak. Hard enough for most players to get a triple-double in any game, but he does it yet again. He delivered some serious all-star caliber basketball tonight. Let's go to Shaq. Uh, what can you say about his performance? That was Freak turning up the volume right there, baby, all the way up to 11. And the stereo only goes to 10, Ernie, but we're at 11 right now. The man himself may be quiet, but his performance spoke very loudly. That was some of the most passionate rebounding work I've ever seen. Guys aren't supposed to be capable of getting that many rebounds in a single game. He was just an animal on the board. It was something special to behold. And that is it for this broadcast of round two of the NBA playoffs. For myself, Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, Kevin Harlan, and the entire 2K Sports crew. Have a great evening, everybody.